Morning everyone, have you had a good week so far? Today's Tuesday, so obviously uh, we're getting into the week. Christmas is mad and it's going on, everyone's rushing around, but we need to keep on track of what we're doing. So obviously staying on form with the Tuesdays. So we're gonna look at a bit of strength exercise today. So I'm working on flexibility, so I'm gonna work on a little bit of strength. And it does help obviously our posture, but we use about, I use this a lot here in the gym with our members when we're doing exercises. And all you need is the thorough band, guys, so you can get, you get one of these. Um, as you use it, so normally it allows elasticity, so you can obviously stretch as you're using it. So, what I want to do is help my posture. So, I'm going to strengthen the muscles in front, so anterior chain, and I'm going to get the posterior chain around the back of the shoulders. Now, obviously, where we sit down a lot during our jobs, we do round, and the shoulders end up getting really, really tight, and the traps get tight, and our posture, everything gets drawn forward. So, the muscles then get long but tight, muscles then get weak but short, so we need to bring them back, strengthen at the front and then strengthen at the back as well and help that, help that chain. Okay, so we, we're better as we sit more upright and we're not rounding all the time like we tend to now, a lot of people do if you're looking down all the time looking at a screen. Right, okay, so very quickly, here's a band. So you can do this to fatigue. There's not a map reps, it's to fatigue, okay? Um, we're just looking at three to four sets. Again, what I put in the uh, post is just do, do it for a couple of minutes where the kettle's boiling, or when you've got a microwave on. So something very, very simple, you could do that three, you could do that a couple of times a day and look at doing it three times a week. Band. So we make it as easy, as hard as you want. So the shorter the band, the harder, the longer the band, the easier. So I'm gonna kind of show you from here. So what I wanted to do is I'm gonna concentrate my breathing as well to help my diaphragm get stronger. So first things first is bring the shoulders back, so push them back and then bring them down. Then from here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna breathe out I'm going to pull this band apart, okay, so you'll see it in a minute. So I'm going to breathe in, take a deep breath in, contract my stomach muscles, shoulders back, squeeze my glutes, have good posture, and I'm going to breathe out. I'm going to do it slowly, and so I'm my breaths out, the band's going to touch my chest. So I'm going to breathe out, so I'm breathing out, breathing out, breathing out, breathing out, breathing out, and the band's touching my chest. Try not to let your shoulders round, push your elbows out and back, okay, so you keep a straight line across. So from there, once the breath's out, and then we're going to breathe in and we're going to control the movement. So I'm breathing in and I'm going to fight that band resistance and straight away you trigger the muscles in front of your shoulder. So we're hitting the muscles across where the pet comes across and then we're going to fight the resistance coming forward. At that point, it's going to show you, I don't want the band just to relax, okay? Don't let it relax, keep tension in that band, okay? Then I go again, so deep breath in and then just breathe out. I'll do this quickly, but obviously you guys get a little bit slower. Push the elbows out, nice and straight, and then I'm breathing in to come forward. Okay, so all I'm gonna do, I'm coming twice slow forward, then I'm, I'm pulling the band apart, so expansion. So then it just, well, before it gets, before it relaxes, I'll show you there, and then it's gonna breathe out. I'll do it quicker, but you guys go a little slower. So you do the fatigue, so what you'll feel is across the front of the shoulder, where the pecs come across, pec minor comes underneath the armpit, and strengthen on here, and we strengthen around the delts and the traps. So you those muscles, get the blood flow back into the muscles at the back, help that posture correction, get the muscles stronger here, then it helps draw the shoulders back. Okay, so we get a better posture, guys, and the muscles get stronger. So it's very, very simple. Just using a thyroid band, most of got these at home, we can get these anywhere. Um, it's just they're not they're not expensive at all. Um, and then try that at home. Very, very basic one with a band. There's other things I can show you, but we'll keep it simple today. So again, you could do it. Uh, when you're cooking dinner, when you're boiling the kettle, even if you're sitting down, you can still sit sitting down while you're watching TV. Any couple of minutes, um, passes the time away between the adverts as well, I want you to film or something. But yeah, do it guys, it will help you, okay? So it will help that posture, but you need to do it more than just once a week. It's looking at three, four times a week, okay? And then try a couple of times a day and you'll feel, obviously it's a lot harder when you're coming forward, because muscles here are weak, you're trying to strengthen them up. Give it a go, let's know you get on. Thank you very much for watching this morning. My name is Mark Hart. This is Have a Half Finish. Have a great day. Thanks, everyone. Bye.